Okay, uh, they have a verdict in Michigan. Let's get you to the courtroom and watch it together. Thank you, everyone. You can be seated. Ladies and gentlemen, the jury, I understand that you have a verdict. Is that correct? A man, are you my court person? I'm going to ask that you hand the envelope to my clerk, Ms. Torres. Ma'am, if you could please stand and read the verdict to the courtroom. Guilty of chemical irritants, unlawful call, unlawful use causing death. Thank you. Judge the jury pulled? Yes, Your Honor. Juror in seat number two, is that Mosette your verdict? Yes. Juror in seat number three, is that Mosette your verdict? Yes. Turn seat number four, is that Mosette your verdict? Yes. Turn seat number five, is that Mosette your verdict? Yes. Turn seat number seven, is that Mosette your verdict? Yes. Turn seat number eight, is that Mosette your verdict? Yes. Turn seat number nine, is that Mosette your verdict? Yes. Turn seat number ten, is that Mosette your verdict? Yes. Turn seat number eleven, is that Mosette your verdict? Yes. Turn seat number twelve, is that Mosette your verdict? Yes. Turn seat number thirteen, is that Mosette your verdict? Yes. Turn seat number fourteen, is that Mosette your verdict? Yes. Anything else? No, Your Honor. No, Your Honor. Ladies and gentlemen of the jury, I will meet you back in the jury room. All right, the jury. Council, um, we'll give you a date with regard to sentencing. Yes, Your Honor. Can the sentencing date in four weeks, please? How far is it to charge? Uh, they may want five. I'm sorry? They may want five, given it's a capital case. Okay. And Your Honor, given that, I'm actually going to move to revoke the bond. And, uh, yeah. Everyone else can be seated. Apologies. 719. 719? 18. 718? 718, 2023. Yeah, I started a trial on the 17th in the pier. 725? I think we can do that. 725? Yes, Judge. Yes. 725, 2023, 830 a.m. We'll need the referral for the PSI. Yes, Your Honor. Go ahead, Mr. Sanis. And Judge, I am moving to revoke bond at this point. I think that's required, actually. Court's going to grant your request. Thank you. Thank you, Your Honor. Okay, we both did a great job. Um, I know that we have a lot of thank for the jury. They did a wonderful job paying attention and really um, participating. So, thank you. Thank you, Your Honor. Thank you, Judge. Please rise. All right, Megan Amerowitz, uh, the reality setting in. She's been found guilty. It's a shocker uh, to a lot of people who have watched this. Shocker that they even came and they've filed these charges against uh, her, according to many, many people believe. Josh Schiffer, Jack Rice, watching along. Um, we're gonna, I'm going to cut you off. We only have a, a bit here, but just quick reactions. Uh, Josh, you first, as we look at this young woman crying, um, your thoughts. Yeah, it's absolutely heartbreaking to me. Um, this is our system's uh, cruel edges uh, because people with discretion made choices on how to charge. Uh, they ignored apparently many other things that happened. Uh, and I, I think that the fundamental promise of fairness and justice was left on the side of the road today. That's yeah. really sad. Jack, quickly. Nobody wins. Nobody wins. Yeah, definitely not Megan. Well, I guess you could say the state of Michigan it can celebrate that their streets are safe now that Megan Amirowitz is going to prison. Uh, yeah. But and I'm disgusted. 
watching this one. This was, it's, it's heartbreaking that the girl was in that environment to begin with. She threw a bunch of stuff on her drunken dad that wouldn't take her to the, get her hair done on her 18th birthday as she had planned. Another disappointment in her life. And then uh, Mr. Prosecutor at all uh, decides to throw the book at her. And yes, you can convince a jury to do anything if you do it right with it in the system, but. Ugh. And they did it in your name. Yeah. Citizens, your name, citizens. <laughs> Usually we, uh, ugh.